Welcome guys to the Outcast Fishing Video. I'm here at Lake Chicoma once again. Very beautiful day out. Very hot. It's been really hot the past like several months. Um, not been too enjoyable. But I'm out here throwing this uh, little Texas rig. We're Texas rigging today. Hoping uh, to actually catch a big fish and who knows, maybe we'll get lucky. If you're wondering what worms that I've been using in the past couple of videos, I'm using uh, some six cents uh, worms. I forgot the name of the first one I was using that I caught fish in my last video. I've unfortunately ran out of them, but uh, I've had some luck on Ned Fry worms from six cents. I just love six cents lures altogether. They're really nice, really well made. Um, soft plastics, they do tear a bit easily. Um, I'd go with a different brand of worms, to be honest, if I were you, but really love the their stuff from Six Cents. Also loving this Corrado DC reel. It's becoming one of my favorites. Still really like my Daiwas. They uh, still cast a bit farther than this DC, but anyway, let's uh, get into the action. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I think that's a bite, right? Yeah, that's a bite. Let's go. Yes, finally. Ah, uh, it's a little guy. It's not that big. Yeah, let's go. I felt it for a bit. I didn't feel like the it moving at all. Yeah, it's a little guy. Not too big. Oh, he hooked himself twice. Yeah, look at that. Not a bad little guy. He hit it and he was so tiny, I didn't feel at first. I thought it was a snag, but it's like, it was reeling in and I had weight on it. Look at that. Pretty little bass, very small though. Much smaller than the one I caught the other evening. But yeah, they're, they're over there. So gotta just keep on casting that way. Sick. There we go. Oh, that's big. Oh, that's so big. Frick. This might be my biggest one ever. What is it? Let's go. This is a nice one. Frick, this one's nice. At least four. Oh, heck yeah. Please don't come off, please don't come off. Please don't come off. No, frick. That was a good four pounder, man. <sighs> you gotta be freaking joking.
Oh, I had a bite. Actually, I do. Wait, there's a fish on. Heck yeah. Let's go. There we go. I had. I thought I had a bite, and then I thought I lost it. It's a little guy though, not super big. Caught him much. Stop it, stop it. Stop it, I'm just trying to help you out, bro. Caught him much closer than the first little guy. Not, not that giant we were looking for that I missed, but it's, it's something. Brings my spirits up a little bit. Okay, buddy, I'm letting you back. Brings my spirits up a little bit. I tell you, if you wanna catch bass at your Como, soft plastics are the way to go. One cast over there, one cast back out in the middle. Yep, there we go, bite. Let's go. Oh, this feels bigger. Oh, let's go. Please be the big one. This feels a bit small. Wait. Oh, it's a tiny one. Frick. It's an itty bitty little guy. Bro, he got water in my mouth. I mean, bigger than the other two. I mean, I did not hook him well at all. There we go, look at that. Third fish of the day. Bigger than the first two, not very big. Bigger than the first two. I'm just, I was just getting ready to leave. And then I was like, you know what? I'll throw over to the right because I've not done that in a while. And then I'll throw back down the middle. So we'll cast over there one more time and he hit it instantly pretty much. Like, as I said earlier, all the fish at Dracomo, at least in this little spot, I feel like they hit almost instantly. Now that big bass I caught or that I hooked into earlier today it wasn't instantly. One more cast. I know I said that last time, but there's just a lot of grass right here and I feel like there's gotta be something big sitting in it. There we go. It's not something big, let's go. Oh, I think I have it hooked badly to where it's it can't fight. Let's go. I said one more cast and there we go. Catch another another bass. This one, oh yes, best bass of the day so far. Absolutely. Good little one pounder. Not nearly as big as that five pounder that got away, but for some reason this one didn't fight at all. Not like super long, but fat boy for a little, for a short little guy. Good little one pounder. What a way to end the night. Okay, I guess, well, you won it away. Uh, two bass, well, I guess three if you think about it on the purple six inch worm. Forget the name of it, and then then two off this green pumpkin little Ned Fry worm that just came out recently, I think. I think it's new, actually. I call that a wrap.